Sell. To sell. Yeah. Everyone, welcome back to Sells to Sell. My name is Heem. This is Nick. Uh, we hope you guys like our intros. What we got going on here, <laughs> freaky. We thought we'd do something fun. But we're back for another Trivia Tuesday. This week we have a... It's just a general science quiz. Yeah, general science quiz, 20 questions, me versus Nick, 10 questions each. Nick is going to go first this time. Mm-hmm. Last time we competed, it was, uh, it was a stalemate. It was a draw. So we're going to see if one of us can assert our <laughs> smartness and not our dominance because we're co-hosts and we're friends. So. All right. I have no idea what this quiz is. It's literally a general science quiz. Yes. So the first question is what is the name of this element? Is it aluminum, boron, iron, or chromium? See, this is a trick question because the, I, I believe that that is a penny, a United States penny. Uh, and and changed. pennies are no longer made out of copper. So I'm going to go with iron. Iron? No, not iron. Is it aluminum? It might be aluminum. It looks pretty soft, actually. Yeah, that's that's aluminum. That's aluminum. Aluminium. Aluminium. That is correct. Nice. That is correct. Question number two. The atomic number for helium is one. True or false? I'm going to have to go with false. It's two. It is, in fact. Dos. Two. And that is what I am. I am. Two for two. Ooh. Call me helium. All right. Question number three. Which of the following is the symbol for lithium? Oh, come on. Is it A, L, what Heem is about to get in this video? Oh! <laughs> is it L, I, N, A, or none of the above? It's L, I. N, N, A. Lithium? Yep. Sure. In your own little world, it can be. <laughs> Question number four. What element has an atomic number of two? Helium. It, no, actually. An atomic number of two. Oh, I think so. Yeah. That's correct. Why? Don't. Don't. Bad, bro. This is your quiz, bro. Yeah. You can, get your, you can get your questions wrong. Don't get mine wrong for me. Question number five. What is the composition of this element? What? You see, I don't know what these rocks are supposed to look like. Dude, it's general science and you don't know it. That's simple as that. It's rocks. Rocks is science. Oh. Okay. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. It's not cobalt or calcium. Calcium's white, I'm pretty sure. Agreed. And cobalt, I think, has like a blue tint, maybe? Yeah, I think so. I'm going to guess iron. It's chromium. Of course it okay. is. It literally is chrome. Iron is, it, but like it's got like the blemishes on the top, and iron, I don't L. know. That was stupid. That was stupid. All right, the symbol for mercury is HG. True or false? That's true. Hug? Yeah. All right, question number seven. Which of the following is the meaning of the symbol AG? Gold, silver, mercury, <laughs> or sodium? Mercury, bro. <laughs> gold. No, it's not. AU is gold. AU is gold. AG is silver. Dude, dude. I, you know, you know when no. you're taking a test and like you're. It's too confident. Yeah, you're like you're just like flying through and then you get it back and you're like, how did I get a 60? Oh, no. That was, I just had one of those moments. Oh, no. Yeah, AU. We've been recording a while. I'm tired. What do you mean? We just this is a new day, dude. It's a new day. Our, cha and our I, clothes have changed. 
just restarted the quiz because I accidentally reloaded the page. So I am, I am, what am I? I have two wrong and I'm on question eight. So I'm five for seven, okay. right? Five for seven. Okay, electrical wiring is commonly made up of what element? Iron, tungsten, copper, or zinc? I'm going to go with copper. Copper wires. It's pretty standard. Good conductors of electricity. Yeah, they pass electrons pretty well. This is made of chromium. Question nine. This is made of chromium. I have no idea. I'm going to go with false, but it's probably true. It is false. Nice. I don't know. I, I have no idea what that was. That looks like a mud pie. Yeah. All right, and then my last question, number 10. So right now I'm seven for nine. Which of the following is the symbol for gold? <laughs> AG, dude? AG, I think it's AG. No, it's AU. Or maybe go. Maybe it's go. G-O. Gold. gold. No, it's AU. All right, eight for 10. Not my best performance. Team picked out this quiz, so. Hey, it's general science. You thought you thought a regenerative medicine guy would do better? Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm playing around. Let's just see how I do. Let's let's be honest. I'll make some silly mistakes. All right. Question 11. Let's get it going. What is the symbol of the element sodium? S <laughs> S O N A S I. Na 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 na. It's na. Next. Question 12. Cu is the symbol of chromium. No, sorry. Cu is copper. Chromium is Cr. So I'm going to say false. Submit. Correct. Two for two. Which of the following is a symbol for silicon? S, Si, C, or Co. S is sulfur. Si is silicone. C is carbon. Co is cobalt. Three for three. Yay. All right. Question number four. What is the symbol of sulfur? S, S-U, S-I, none of the above. Uh, I don't think it's S-U. I don't think it's S-I. I think it's S. So, four for four. Dude, I'm killing this, Nick. I get to pick next quiz. Oh, he gets to pick next quiz. Sure, okay. Fifteen. What is represented by this element? Oh my god, what even is that? Exactly. Well, let me see it. Boron, carbon, beryllium, lithium. It's not lithium and it's not carbon. You see the boron? Oh, I know. A oh, boron is like this brownish liquid. Believe it or not. So I'm going to say beryllium. Because beryllium, I think, is a metal. Obviously. It's true! <laughs> I got that right. I thought you were gonna get that wrong because I thought that was coal. Oh. And I thought it was gonna be carbon. Nah. No. All right, sixteen. Five for five. What element is inside the vial? Looks like a bunch of small little dots, like sand, metal sand. Gold, silver, tungsten, titanium. Not gold. I think titanium comes like that. Little pellets, either that or tungsten. It's not gold, it's not silver. It could be silver, I'm just gonna say silver. Oh, it's tungsten. Oh no. Five for six. All right, which of the following is the symbol of oxygen? O, O, X, N, none of the above, it's O. It's O, X. It's O, X. <laughs> Shoot. I got it right. <laughs> Seven for eight. The symbol for nitrogen is <laughs> Ni. That's nickel. Nickel. Haha, uh -huh, nickel. Yeah, it's false. Nitrogen is just N. I am killing this. The chemical symbol for neon is Ne. True. Neon is Ne. That's question nine. Final question for me. 20 out of 20. Which of the following is a complete name of Sir Riz? What? 
Loristi localingacion. Loristi localingacion. Loristi localingacion. What? Who is Sir Riz? What? Oh, that's you get this wrong with Ty. I'm just gonna say A. Oh, it's C. Let me see if I clutch it. That is the worst question I've ever seen in my life. You wanna come back in? Oh. No, I'm looking up who Sir Riz is. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. Um, 18 out of 20 total? What did we get total? We got... I got one question wrong. I got two wrong. So we got 16 out of 19. We're throwing out that last question. Sure. That was stupid. That means I won. Sure, you did. On a technicality. On a anyway, <laughs> it's okay. It's fine. Yeah. Again, these were all fun. We're just going back and testing ourselves. And, you know, who who likes watching somebody that's right all the time? That's ho like, it's ho horrifically boring, if you already know that. If you came into every Trivia Tuesday and we got every single question right, who cares? Boring. Right? So we, we want to challenge ourselves in even going back to high school chemistry <laughs> and learning our elements. You know, sometimes you can mess them up, like silver and gold. One's worth a lot more than the other. That's all I'll say. So, are right, you got anything else for this trivia Tuesday? That's all. All right. Well, um, we just want to say thank you for watching. Go ahead and hit the like and subscribe button. Um, but yeah, I'm Nick. That's him, and this has been Sells to Sell. See you guys. Thanks.